I, I got a I got a fun question for you. Okay. McKinnon, mm -hmm. Landis Cog, mm -hmm. Duchesne. Mm -hmm. In ten years, Oof. which of those three, or how many of those three will we be talking about as Abs? Hall of Famers. Ooh, it's Hall of Famer. Ten years? Yeah. Well, first of all, McKinnon's no, no, only no. twenty. Not, no, not that they're going to be in it by then. Oh, they'll, they'll, but they'll eventually... we'll be talking about them as probable Hall of Famers. Do I have to tell you which ones? Well, that's the question. Okay. I, <laughs> I was just going to say two or three just to, to save myself. but Okay. Um, yeah, all right. I don't want to get you in trouble with the players. Then. Yeah. No, how, no, no, how no. Many, how many of them? Um, you know, Hall of Fame is really hard to make. Um, Jerome McGinley, what does he have? 680 goals or something. Uh, you know, to, be, to, to, to respect the guys that are in the Hall of Fame, I would probably say one. I mean, one it's really hard. And I can't tell you which one it's going to be, but well, they all, I'll, they all, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you which, which one. one. You think it's McKinnon? It's McKinnon, McKinnon yeah. Well, McKinnon. yeah. But you know what? I, I think all three are fabulous players, along with Ryan O'Reilly. Right. right. Well, and look, boy, Ryan O'Reilly. I mean, it's been a it's been, it's been a, a different kind of year for him. But with in my personal opinion, there isn't anybody with better hands than Ryan O'Reilly. You're going to make me eat that brownie. I'm not going to make oh, it. Just have a bite. Take it home to your dog. <laughs> God. To your dog. Don't feed that. Put it back. Or um, Ryan O'Reilly is. They call it, they rink rats. You know the rink rat deal. First one there, last one to leave. Oh yeah, yeah. That's he really is that guy. O'Reilly. Uh, O'Reilly. I mean, he's just. He does things on the ice that are just awesome to watch. Yeah, I love his game. McKinnon, though, I go go back to that. McKinnon has. He idolized Joe Sackett, mm -hmm. even though he was so young, he didn't really get to see much of his career, did he? But I think. He uh, is of that quality that he is a Joe Sackick. He doesn't look, he's not a Joe Sackick lookalike. Right. But I think he will have the same kind of career if this team is good. Yeah. And it's going to require, because Joe Sackick, when he came in the league, he was with a bad, young Quebec, Quebec Nordiques. And he was a great player right away, but it took a little while for that team to develop. They had to get a Peter Forsberg. And so, if if they can surround him, get, get better defensemen, and they get a little bit more consistency, consistency, and and he's not, and he's healthy again. Right. Uh, I think he's going to have because you said it. He's 20 years old. That means he can play for 15 years. Right.